Hi friends, now we are solving problem on differential calculus. Given problem is prove that tan inverse x is equal to x minus x cube by 3 plus x to the power of 5 by 5 minus x to the power of 7 by 7 plus so on. By the observation, you can say tan inverse x expansion in powers of x. So in generally, to expand tan inverse x in powers of x, we apply Maclaurin series expansion. But in this case, we are uh, not applying Maclaurin series. We are applying special method. That method is known as expansion by using differentiation, integration of known series. Now, working rule. Here, we first use the differentiation and obtain a series. Then, use the term by term integration and put x is equal to 0 for the integration constant. Friends, you see, in this case, first they will give f of x function. Let us consider y is equal to f of x. Now, you use the differentiation. If you are differentiated, then you will get y dash is equal to f dash of x. So, f dash of expansion, we know. f dash of x expansion, we know. After that, what we have to do? Just you integrate on both sides. Then integration of y dash dx will be integration of f dash of x to dx. Yes or no? Then you will have y is equal to f of x, capital F of x plus c. So in this case, we have to put x is equal to 0. Then this function will be 0. You will get a c value. Later you substitute c value. That gives the expansion of given function. Now let y is equal to tan inverse x. Consider this as equation number 1. Now you differentiate uh, equation 1 with respect to x. Then y dash is equal to tan inverse x derivative to 1 by 1 plus x square. Friends, this 1 by 1 plus x square you can also write as 1 plus x square whole inverse. Friends, we know the expansion, binomial expansion like 1 plus t whole inverse is equal to 1 minus t plus t square minus t cube plus t to the power of 4 so on okay in place of t we have x square then in this case y dash is equal to 1 minus t what is the t you have x square plus t square means x to the power of 4 minus t cube means x square whole cube means x to the power of 6 plus so on now what we are done here just we are differentiated but we want y expansion so use the term by term integration it gives integral of y dash is equal to integral of 1 minus x square plus x to the power of 4 minus x to the power of 6 and so on into dx this integration and the derivative getting cancelled then you will have y is equal to term by term integration we are doing integral of 1 is x minus x square integration is x cube by 3 plus x to the power of 4 integration is x to the power of 5 by 5 minus x power 6 integration is x to the power of 7 by 7 plus so on you will get a integral constant is c now we have to substitute x is equal to c to get the integral constant if you are substituted x is equal to 0 then we get a y is equal to 0 0 0 0 plus c so y is equal to c actually what is the y here you have y is a tan inverse x so that is tan inverse uh, x is equal to c but where we are discussing x at x is equal to 0 so c is tan inverse 0 what is the tan inverse 0 we have 0 only therefore the integral constant will be 0 now you substitute this integral constant in this e expansion then we will have y is equal to x minus x cube by 3 plus x to the power of 5 by 5 minus x to the power of 7 by 7 plus so on. So friends, is it clear for you how to expand the given function by using differentiation and integration of known series? Remember, I will repeat again. First, you consider the given function as a y and differentiate a y with respect to x. Later, you will get a known series. So, by use any formula, you will get the series expansion. After that, you use the integration term by term. Then, you will get the integral constant. In the integral constant, to get the integral constant, we have to put x is equal to 0. Then, we will get c value. c is equal to 0, which gives the required expansion. Okay, friends. Thank you for watching this video. If you want, you can note down.